Hi, in this video I wanted to show you an example of the five different types of opal that I provide for this ring or for any of the rings or necklaces in my shop. You can choose a solid black Australian opal like this one. Let me see if I can get that in better focus for you. This is one of my 8 by 6 millimeter solid black Australian opals. And I want to show you another one because I want you to see how different these opals are from each other and you can choose your own opal from my collection on video. This is another Australian black opal and look at all the red fire in this one. So they are quite different from each other and you should always look at the videos in order to see your opal in the light because still pictures don't really do it justice. They only show you one angle. Now you'll notice that the prongs are up on this ring once I set the stone, of course, these prongs would be folded over the stone. But since I'm showing you five different types of opal, I wanted you to see this with the prongs up so I can exchange this out. This is a beautiful ring design. This is design A303. It has got beautiful filigree on the sides. And of course, as with all my rings, I offer this in yellow gold, white gold, rose gold, or sterling silver. This is a sterling silver one that I'm using in the example here. Another type of opal that I use frequently in the shop is called a natural Australian opal triplet. And Let me get this one in here for you. Not easy to do. I need three hands here. I'll show it to you first in my hand. A natural Australian opal triplet is a slice of natural opal sandwiched between a black piece of glass to darken the background and a crystal cap over the top of the opal which you can see there see that crystal cap which protects your opal so if you're going to wear this ring every day some people like to have a triplet because they're very beautiful I have mine cut from the finest rough available meaning the finest opal available many people have their triplets cut from inferior opal but mine are so colorful and beautiful because I have them cut from fine opal, which is usually just reserved for cutting solid opal. So that's an opal triplet. I'll put it in the ring. Got it in the ring there. And uh, you can see how when I moved it in the light, you could see all of its colors. And once again, once I set this opal in the setting, it will sit flat and the prongs would be down. So that's an example of one of my top gem grade opal triplets. I do sell them in AAA grade and top gem grade. The next one I want to show you is this beautiful opal I had cut for me. This is faceted Ethiopian opal. And you can see it's been cut with faceted angles on it. You can't facet Australian opal like you can facet Ethiopian opal. And Ethiopian opal is just absolutely beautiful solid opal. And you can see all the colors in it. I really like, for this particular ring design, I really like this faceted Ethiopian opal as a choice. Let me get that in focus for you. There you go. Isn't it beautiful? I love that. I have matching earrings in that. So that's faceted Ethiopian white opal. And this is an example of some faceted Ethiopian black opal. It's quite dark. It almost looks like blue sapphire. It's got green and dark blue fire. See how dark blue that is? So that's Ethiopian black opal. And then here's another Ethiopian black opal cut in a cabochon. The other one I just showed you was faceted. And this is a cabochon. Cabochon is flat on the back. Here I'll show you. Flat on the back and rounded on the top. So I have the black Ethiopian opal and cabochons. Let me see if I can slide it in there for you. There you go. So it would look quite different depending on which type of opal you choose for this design or any of my ring designs in the shop. And then of course I have white Ethiopian cabochons. Let me 
see if I can get this at the right angle. Not easy to do. There you go. This is a white Ethiopian capuchon and you can see it has beautiful sparkling colors. Pale reds and greens. And that's an example of a white Ethiopian opal cabochon for this ring or any of my rings. So those are the five types of opal you have to choose from. And again, remember the rings can be yellow gold, white gold, rose gold, or sterling silver. Thanks for watching my sample video.